Los Angeles, Adam Rich, the child actor with a page boy mop top who charmed TV audiences as America's little brother on 8 is enough, has died. He was 54. Rich died Saturday at his home in the Brentwood section of Los Angeles, said Lt. Amy Earl of the Los Angeles County Medical Examiner Coroner's Office. The cause of death was under investigation but was not considered to be suspicious. Rich had a limited acting career after starring at age 8 as Nicholas Bradford, the youngest of 8 children, on the ABC hit dramedy that ran from from 1977 to 1981. He had several run-ins with police related to drugs and alcohol, and sought treatment at the Betty Ford Center in Rancho Mirage. Rich suffered from a type of depression that defied treatment and he had tried to erase the stigma of talking about mental illness, said publicist Danny Durainney. He unsuccessfully tried experimental cures over the years. Durainey said he and others close to Rich were worried in recent weeks when they couldn't reach him. Nick Hutt, AP slash AP former Eight is Enough child actor Adam Rich appeared in a Van Nuys, California, court on August 20, 1991. He was just a very kind, generous, loving soul, Durainey told the Associated Press. Being a famous actor is not necessarily what he wanted to be. He had no ego, not an ounce of it. Rich discussed his mental health on Twitter and noted in October that had been sober for seven years. He said he was imperfect, referring to arrests, many stints in rehab, several overdoses and countless detoxes, and, relapses, and urged his nearly 19, 000 followers to never give up. Human beings weren't built to endure mental illness, Rich tweeted in September. The mere fact that some people consider those to be weak, or have lack of will is totally laughable. Because it's the total opposite. It takes a very, very strong person. A warrior if you will. To battle such illnesses. Rich posted a picture of himself from his heyday with one time child star Mickey Rooney. Everyone used to say to me, you are the modern day Mickey Rooney, he tweeted. But when Mickey Rooney told me that himself, it meant a hell of a lot more to me. Nearly 27 years ago, Rich participated in a hoax that Mike Magazine published about the actor getting killed in a robbery outside a Los Angeles nightclub in 1996.